Inset the 3.5 inch SATA HDD, then mount the 3.5 inch HDD by 4 pieces M3 times A screws. <laughs> Fix 4 pieces M2.5 times A screws with M3 times 32 spacers. Okay, and here we must take notice. Firstly, we need to plug the two pin power cable into the power dot board, and then these two pin power cables should be connected to the 5 voltage out port on the X75 SATA board. The USB cable should be plugged into the Raspberry Pi's USB 3 port and the upper port on the XA35 board. Like this. For the fan connection, the fan should be connected in this direction. Please remove the power on jumper cap when connecting external switch. should be connected to the 5 voltage out port of the XA35 board.
Now we show how to install with X735 power management bot. The PWR on jumper cap must be removed when used with X735 board. This PWR on jumper cap must be removed when used with X735 board. The latching switch pin must be shorted when used when connect the latching switch on the X735 board. The power supply must be connected to the DC 12 voltage in ports on the X835 board only. Please do not plug into the X735 board or the Raspberry Pi board. X735 board, there is no need to install the crane fan which put inside the case. <laughs>